In San Francisco tonight, the story of second chances and second thoughts. A man who went to prison for his gang-related crimes has been given a job overseeing a city-funded program. ABC 7's Vic Lee is in the newsroom tonight. And Vic, some people have serious reservations about this decision. Well, Dan, for one, the mayor. Now, he's ordered his staff to see if it's now improper to give money to the Chinatown night market. And that's a street market that's held on Saturdays during the summer. In fact, the mayor's office held a meeting Friday to see just what their options are now that the former gangster is in charge. Pretty much like a brother and sister. Raymond Chow, also known as Shrimp Boy, was meeting today with the staff of the Chinatown night market. As a magnanimous gesture, the new general manager is accepting just a dollar in pay. I can promise you, I do my best. The best, you know, for the community. Chow was once a notorious gangster in Chinatown. He went to prison on a racketeering conviction, but was released six years ago after he testified against his gang boss. Chow now heads Chi Kong Tong, the Chinese Freemasons, the job businessman Alan Liang held before he was killed two years ago. His murder is still unsolved. Last week, the Chinatown Neighborhood Association chose Chow to run the night market. And sources say that worries the mayor because his office gives the program a $35,000 grant. Supervisors President David Chu represents Chinatown. He wants the funding to stop. Given the difficult and challenging history of the night market, uh, given the current budget crisis that we're in, and given the new players that are allegedly involved, uh, I, I have significant questions about what has been proposed. Former co-chair of the group, Benny E, helped select Chow. You have to give a chance to a person who has made mistake. You cannot continue saying that he's a bad guy, no. E says other candidates who expressed interest pulled out. Chow says rumors that he intimidated them are untrue. I've been monitored by law enforcement 24-7, you know, and if I have anything, doing anything like this, definitely we'll be out there. So Chow says City Hall has no reason to worry. So you can look the mayor in the eye and say, look, Mayor Gavin Newsom, I'm a reformed man. Yes. Absolutely. I can look not just the mayor, anybody. Well, the mayor's office did not return our calls, but a source close to the mayor tells us he does want to rescind that money. They're also worried about a power grab. Chow put six members from his group, the Qigong Tong, on the night market's board. I asked him why. He told me, quote, I encourage all of my members to participate in civic activities. Vic Lee, ABC 7 News.